Dreams of Dream been all over. I would have had my shirt on today, but for some reason, hey. But I don't know what you was thinking. I put the Tim and Tim P. How they sleep on me. Niggas is gonna call the fact to speak on me, let alone critique on me. They want me to crash out, but I got too much at stake to let them T-bone me. But if you looking for us, know where we gon' be. T.O.P. I give it to him, P.O.V. Can see it through my eyes, that's the kilo key. You was quick to pay a visit cause you needed me. Now I gotta hit you when I'm free cause you got cheap on me. It would be crazy for you to cheat on me. Knowing when you see me, you see heat on me. C-H-E-A-T on me. We can have relations, you can freak on me. Just take the ship away, Rick Bettine on me. You blew it, that ship has sailed. You moved don't know what he's back talking about. Let me talk about the Dreamers Market real quick. So, yesterday we had the Dreamers Market. So, what the Dreamers Market is, is like, my brand, Drills to Dreams, we bring together 12 vendors, food, snow cones, we had scrubs out there, we had a pharmacy. We bring them all together at my, at my high school and we had a marketplace before the football game. And so like, it was such a success because like a lot of students came through and shopped. And uh, basically the school asked us to do it every single Friday um, of the football season for home games. And so like right now, we're gonna have some meetings. I'm gonna meet with my team to figure out like what the logistics look like and everything like that. And uh, I think it's like really gonna be big for the brand because it's gonna give us a lot of brand recognition as our event. And then we'll do one that's bigger than that. But uh, yesterday was great. Uh, we got sales, we probably, we probably had about 12 sales at the event. Um, but what I love most is that all the businesses was eating. And so uh, that's, that's gonna make them wanna come back. So every time we'll be able to fill up the vendor spots, which means, um, you know, people gonna automatically be at the football game. So. You come to the football game, you know you're going to get something good to eat. You know you're going to be able to get you some new clothes or a snow cone to cool you down. I think that'll, that'll be like a plus for the, whole, for the whole school and the whole game period, the whole game experience. So um, yesterday, 10 out of 10, and uh, I think we're going to run it back next Friday as well. So next Friday, I'll do a better job of like vlogging. Yesterday, I was running everywhere. I got out of school, went straight down, had to get a haircut. So I set up, had to go get a haircut, came back, everything was all set up and good and flowing. And then just like a lot of vendors had a lot of questions as far as like where they was. We had vendors try to pull up without like, without like letting us know that they would be there. So we just had a, had a long day yesterday. But uh, like I said, it was a good event. And 14? I thought it was 225. Did y'all do like three X's and stuff too? 214 then. Maybe not. Uh, I don't remember them saying, asking, because like sometimes 10 will be missing because like a size or whatever. Yeah. Here. I don't remember them asking about when they stacked it out there being a, a cash counter on the front end of the bed. And it's 214 front and back. 214? Yeah. Cool. 214 then. You be a freak and a friend too. Yeah. You into everything I'm into. Oh, I got some. Put the kids on that. <laughs> <laughs> Look how big. We're at the firm. I want me a chicken on a stick and a funnel cake to start off. I don't know why she wants this chicken on a stick. It's just very convenient that the chicken is on a stick. You better eat it too for $15. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna eat 
that he was complaining about. It's all right. It's not to die for. They definitely need a season. Oh, yeah. Jay. I want to start by saying the prices at the fair are ridiculous. That's all I want to say. Let me see. We see. We got two people, four people, including us with the brand on. So y'all know. Y'all know. Y'all know. Y'all know. And I told him, that's my brand. What you talking about, bro? How's it tasting? It's so good. It's better than the chicken on the stick. Everything's been good. Only thing is, like, uh, things been kind of slower because I end up going back to work. Uh, so I am a school teacher. Uh, I'm a substitute this year for middle school. Um, so now, like everything's just kind of not really slowed up because it's also a season change. So we getting a lot of the summer stuff out, and then we got the fall stuff coming in. So uh, we just got the hoodies. We here at the photo shoot. I got the models coming in. I'm just here a little early just to scope out the scene. So um, there's like three, four places down here that I definitely gonna show y'all. Um, for the for us to do these hoodies, so we got five different hoodies, five different de five different colors, not five different hoodies. Uh, they say I'm not sorry for believing in my dreams. Um, the property of a dreamers, they just didn't really, they ain't do what I thought they was gonna do. But you know, it's all good. We we uh, we not gonna trip about that. So now it's just really on to the next thing. So we got the jerseys releasing on Friday. And then we, which is in two days, and then we got the hoodies that's gonna release the weekend after that. So uh, everything's good. Like I said, I'm just here. I'm gonna scope out everything and then kind of go from there. Um, one of my goals is to get this online uh, ramped up. So what I'm trying to do now is just get so much content because right now I don't really know, you know, what's gonna hit, you know, what my customers like to see yet. So I'm just kind of doing everything. I'm doing pictures on the floor. I got pictures with the models, um, like I got reels. So we we gonna get everything in right now. And then, uh, yeah, that's really it, man. Life's great. My son's about to be due. I mean, my son's about to be here in about two weeks. So, you know, uh, that's, gonna, that's gonna turn us up as well. Um, so yeah, everything's good, man. So y'all stay tuned right here. Like I said, we got three different, three different spots right here. We definitely gotta, I definitely gotta show y'all one. Uh, this one spot over here with it's like a broke down building look and it just it just gives off hard work to me so my eyes white chef but it keeps on moving I blame it on the model bra with the Hollywood smile strip a booty with the rack like wow I'll never forget ya you put me on a field and I never had never had never had I've been trying to get it back, you pick it up, put it back. Now I'm something like the chemist on campus, but there's no drug around. I like what I found, you and you. I still can't feel my facts, but am I smoking anyway? We never, we never got to have our media meeting, but like, this is how I want like each photo shoot to go. So like, you on the camera, you on the video, and then, like, when you get done, we could all drop it in one place. So I know you, the weed transfer. Like we transfer. Yeah, we transfer, we transfer. That's yeah. what he used. Like, that's what I use, like, after the final product. I do clip by clip and put it all. Oh, well, yeah, I'm doing pictures. So I always have yeah. my editing and stuff, yeah. and then I drop it in the weed transfer. So okay. what you could be on more so, like, behind the dreams and the reels, uh, which is, that's, like, that Instagram stuff. And then what you're doing is more so for, like, so, ads, yeah. the website, and stuff like that.